Okay, this is the Radio Shack uh, USB uh, scanner cable, 2546. Uh, we're going to unpack this. Uh, inside the box you will find the uh, cable. This is the cable that will connect the scanner to your PC. One side is a USB connector that will plug in the PC. The other side is a uh, connector that plugs into the scanner. Over here I have an example. On the side of the scanner you have a, a PCIF connection. So this cable plugs into this jack over there. Before we can use the cable we have to install the software. The software comes on a CD-ROM. The CD-ROM is the both a driver uh, software and trial software. Also in the box you will find a conversion cable. Uh, for most scanners this conversion cable is not necessary, so you just uh, put it aside. Okay, we are now going to install the software, the driver software from the CD-ROM. So I'm going to put the CD-ROM in the CD-ROM drive. And I'll just have to wait a little bit. So for now we can cancel this, because this will install the uh, demo uh, scanner software, but we first have to install the driver software. So I just hit uh, cancel and confirm this, and then this will finish and it will close. So now we go to uh, my computer on your desktop, you select double click on my computer. And now you will see, uh, look for the CD-ROM drive, in our case our drive is E, the CD-ROM is E. It's called Scanner Software. Now do a right mouse button click and then select Open. Now we'll see the contents of the CD-ROM. And we are running Windows XP on this system, but if you run Windows 7, Windows Vista, Windows XP or Windows 2000, double click this icon. This will open the uh, folder. And then you will see the driver software, it's called CDM20600. Just double click this icon. Now you'll see this uh, window. And now the uh, driver software is installed on our PC. To check if the uh, software was correctly installed, we now plug the USB cable in a free USB port. And then we should hear the Windows Yes. So now we see over here on the desktop, we see found new hardware. So after installing the driver, Windows recognized the, uh, the USB cable and now the uh, cable is ready for use.